Now, health experts have advised Nigerians and doctors to conduct comprehensive tests on fever-related cases to ensure they are malaria before treatment. The National Malaria Elimination Program advises this as malaria cases continue to rise globally, with Nigeria accounting for 27% of recorded cases and death are 31% as NMR 2023. Woody Tanko recommends prompt diagnosis and treatment with recommended anti-malaria drugs. One of our major, major, major interventions is for us to be able to diagnose adequately. And when we mean diagnose adequately, we do not want presumptive diagnosis. Just because you have a fever, you have the normal symptoms that you think you experience when you have malaria, then you go ahead and start taking medicines. That's not what we want. The group advocates for media collaboration with the government to raise awareness and educate citizens about the significance of malaria testing before treatment. By environmental sanitation through advocacy, communication and social mobilization. And I tell you this morning that this advocacy, communication and social mobilization activities cannot be achieved without the media. Poor drainages. Rainfalls, your drainages, your, 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 they remain, they collect water. Go there in three, four days. Mosquitoes, everything that will promote the breeding of mosquitoes in our environment is there. The temperature, the humidity, the altitude, uh, uh, altitude then you now help them by providing a habitat, that is water. So if we're able to work on this, honestly, we are going to crash down because if the lava does not grow to mosquito, mosquito will not come to our neighborhood. We test every fever case that comes to the hospital. Okay? It's very, very important we test just so that we're able to accurately or treat the disease, confirm it, and then treat it appropriately. By doing that, you will save the person the economic implications or the economic burden of the disease, you will prevent the risk of um, drug resistance because these organisms too are also trying to survive. Medical experts advise not all fever is malaria, taking prescribed drugs, maintaining cleanliness, and conducting a proper test before malaria treatment. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.